Interior Principal Secretary Karanja Kibisho says preparations for the Jamhuri Day celebrations at the historic Uhuru Gardens are on final touches. Kibicho, who toured the venue, said most of the works are complete with only a few touches on decorations remaining. The Sunday celebration will only be marked in Nairobi and not in counties due to the COVID-19 pandemic. <laughs> Preparations at the historic park are on top gear ahead of the 58th Jamhuri Day celebrations on Sunday. <laughs> Principal Secretary for Interior Karanja Kibicho, after assessing the stadium, said most of the work is now complete. However, there will be no unveiling of memorial or heroic establishments which are still under construction. For Sunday, we are coming strictly for Jamhuri Day celebration. You can see there is still work ongoing on uh, this space. And I think if we continue and open it up, we only come after this site, this uh, facility is the one that's complete to host uh, Jamhuri Day. So the rest will be finished in the succession and after will be advised. Due to COVID-19 pandemic, Counties will not hold any events and only 10,000 guests will occupy the public seating area and 1,000 are the main dais at the stadium. The venue is set to be opened by 4.30 a.m. with the public expected to be seated by 8.30 a.m. before the event kicks off at 10.30 a.m. A notice has already been issued to halt any flights on the path of Wilson Airport to avoid distracting the event. The public can also take advantage of a COVID-19 vaccination center that will be set up at Uchumi Supermarket that will run from the 12th and 13th of December 2021. Kamche Menzam for Prime Edition.